Hey everyone, my name is Harvey T. I'm a little bit more active. Sorry this video is coming out late. It's um I didn't sleep and then uh passed out and woke up two hours ago. And then I've been trying to get things working. Don't do that. Sorry, go to stop here just if you stand with the phone. Don't you know. Hi girl. I don't I haven't recorded a video. I had footage, but like I said, YouTube doesn't like when I take footage off of its app. And uh, here's Coda. Welcome to the hockey. Um, she was born, um, I've got, had her since, like, May? And, um, she was born March 4th, and, uh, I've had her since, she's really not. The pain in my butt, but she's family. And, no, this isn't for, for money, fair game, or click pay or anything. Um, I just want to let you guys know she's part of the family. She's here, and we're getting a new member, and we do pass the check. Um, I'll do a vlog later. Uh, anyways, Q&A time. Right, I got enough questions this time. I also have some cool ones that I originally had because I didn't have a question. First one, do you know this number? I'm not including that number because it might be someone's actual number. This was by Spindler Matthew in the... No, I don't know that number. I'm not saying anything because it might be someone's number and I don't want you guys to be persisting buggy that person. Uh, next up is by It's Adrian, 03, in tax play, autistic. You shouldn't go with that. Why did you start music? Don't do that! Hey. Come on. No. Um, why did I start YouTube? Well, originally it was, um... I don't know why I did that. It's been like three years, so I wouldn't remember. But, well, my reason for doing YouTube now is because I have fun. I get to meet new people, and um, I get to do stupid stuff, and you guys get to laugh at it, because you get like moments. Anyways, continuing on, by underscore J underscore Dizzy, J Dizzy, is what is your favorite character you designed to find? My favorite character is H, because originally he was a human version of my username Harley, which was also me, and then, I, like I said, I pushed him away and became something more. And I like when he came out. Originally, it was um, gray button up, white t shirt, and black hair, brown eyes, and skin, like me. And then it came red shirt, blue jeans, and one black, the black eye, red eye, but it was brown, and the blue eye, still black hair. And then it became. Stripe, still brown eye, then eventually I changed it where he had long, oh, long under sleeve. And that's my reason why is because he's been here for a very long time. Well, Jake has, but I really didn't really feel emotional about it. I just didn't because I don't know. Jake's been there for a very long time because he reminds me of the fun times I had with my friends on PlayStation 3. We've all moved on though. So I won't be able to hang out with some of them. So yeah. I can't get in contact with them because some of them really don't like talking to me. And I don't know what I did. Next, J G G dot draws. If you could be, if you could live somewhere else, where would you live in line? Uh Canada. Because I wanna get away from family. Um it would be Toronto, I think. I would live there. I just like the idea of living somewhere cooler, because I live in the desert. It's hot. My room's hot. I have a Air on my window open and a fan blind. I should probably turn that off. I have to read the phrase. Anyways, yeah, I like Canada because it's far and farther away from home. And my family's all clumped in the US and around the, in the same state. And I just want to get away from here because it's too clumped, it's too personal, too everything. Next is Sapphire Locks likes a lot of stuff. If you had one more day to live, what would you do? Tell everyone I have one more day to live and probably just have as much fun as I can. Um, don't stop it. Um, yeah, just have a blast and hang out with all my friends and tell the emotions that I had kept for a really long time. Yeah, personal. Kind of dark. Next is Wolf A, digital or traditional art style. Which I prefer. Um, I prefer traditional. Because I have more, because I can feel the paper, I can feel the pencil, I can feel what I'm drawing and see it right there in front of me. Well, and then I like, but I don't really like sticking to it because then I'm limited to a certain amount of things because I'm not very adept. 
adapt to do other things. I'm not, um, good at watercolor, acrylic, even color pencil I suck at because I'm just not that good. But, um, uh, I kind of prefer digital more because I'm able to do a lot more. It gives me more options what to do. Just down my it gives me, uh, gives me more options on stuff I can be able to do, like, uh, flip, uh, smudge, glow, and all that stuff. It gives me more stuff, especially my phone. I have had a lot of stuff missing from the, my phone version. Anyways, next, Carlo Carbon. Do you have a ghost story? Sadly, I do not. I have never encountered any kind of ghost or, I, uh, what was it called? Paranormal, anything like that. I had a nightmare, it still terrifies me. I actually drew it, but it was in it, and it just, yeah. Anyways, uh, it's Adrian again, 03. What's your opinion on YouTube being broken? It sucks, it seriously sucks, because I know how it feels. Um, I don't know if I ever told you guys this, I think I did in my last one. Um, that YouTube, uh, I did a stream, you guys have been here for a long time, Planet Site 32. Uh, I did a stream, you know guys, like, if you think I'm on that, like, done streams on that. And, um, when, I then, like, three months after I did a stream, I was at my sister's softball game, and I got a notification on my old phone, my streaming, my first phone. It says, hello, the original is still Harley King. Hello, Harley King, you've been, you've been given a copyright strike for a bit, uh, song in one of your streams, or in one of your videos, and disclosed what the video was, and I looked through it. And um, all I heard was uh, the noise from the game. And he talked to my friends. And he was like, nothing like that. And I'm like, thinking, I'm like, how can I stop copyright music? Lie. Anyways, uh, next, spin the math again. What do you see yourself doing in 10 years? Either dead, dead inside, or being a graphic artist, or surviving the world, or wilderness. Those are my options. Hey, yeah. Another by Skitty Bumbum Shlom. Still fresh to that name. Are you excited for school? No, I hate school. It is horrible. I get to learn stuff that has no meaning or purpose in the real world. Like I said, which I learned my possible uh, 10 years is looking in the wilderness. That. Um, school isn't really that exciting for me. Um, because I'm always pressured to be my best, do the best. That's so all that matters here. Being your best is all that matters. Being your lowest, your lowest, nobody cares. Because, you know, being the lowest, um, nobody cares because you're not giving them anything. That no one wants anything from the lowest point in your life. Well, that would be in the social world, but then there's people who actually care. But then they do care about your lowest, and your highest, and they congratulate you, they help you up, they help you move along. That stuff. Kinda got sad. Um, Andres Lopez, 2003. Who is your biggest inspiration for art? I don't really have an inspiration, one inspiration for art. All the artists I find, I like their art. It inspires me to draw. Like some things, like I play Legend of Zelda, and I'm like, you know, like, I want to draw Link. Because Legend of Zelda has been my favorite game. But banging our back on track, all the artists I see and we talk to, they inspire me. They make me bigger, they help me get better. If I see a part of their art, I'm like, that's cool, I should try that. And I try their style and try to make mix it into mine, which make my own style out, which is kind of a Frankenstein thing. A patchwork of different styles that makes my own. Um, and for the last one, Fabian M L M, do you think the earth is flat? No, I think it's round. Sorry for any flat earthers or anything, but I've grown up knowing that the earth is round. Or spherical. It's not going to be round. Or globe, whatever. And um, I've always thought of that like that. Uh, so, here it is spherical. Uh, yeah. Hopefully, we'll get more questions next time. There was a lot this time. And a lot of people. Uh, if you guys want to. Like, I actually be doing a vlog, probably, when we get a new uh, member. I'll be doing a vlog with uh, Coda, so you get to see that soon. And if you notice, I did shave, yes. I appreciate 
you don't care. Who cares? But uh, if you guys want to join in the next uh, Q and A next Tuesday, uh, just leave your com uh, question in the comment section, and I'll add them in the next video. Um, thanks for watching. See you guys next time.